Yes, yeah, so the queen marks her 60 years as Britain's monarch. The official anniversary is this Monday. And starting tomorrow, a new photo exhibit shows the stoic figure at work and at play. Charlie Daggett is at Windsor Castle just outside of London this morning. Charlie, good morning. Good morning to you, Erica. You know, the big celebrations for the Queen's Jubilee really don't kick off until the summertime. Uh, but before we look at the future here at Windsor Castle, we've had a chance to look at her past. Queen Elizabeth II is about to open the doors of Windsor Castle to the public. On show, a royal collection of candid photographs. 60 photos for 60 years on the throne, which show the world's most famous monarch in a very different light. The public, the private, the formal, and the more friendly. And I think what's very distinctive about this exhibition is there are so many pictures of Smiley Queen. There's a big focus on family, including the proud moment when Prince William graduated from Sandhurst Military Academy and appears to stifle a laugh. No such reserve for the Queen herself, however, as one of her horses romps home. Isn't that amazing? We always think of the Queen as being very measured, you know, very unspontaneous, every detail sought out. And then this fantastic, yes! An early, more formal photo shows the Queen during a state visit from John and Jacqueline Kennedy and, dressed down, riding alongside President Reagan on the castle grounds. Of the 12 presidents who have served under her reign and counting, did she ever let on that she had any favorites? The queen would never be so indiscreet. But they also show that life can be lonely at the top. This is one of the photos that sticks out, you know, 60 years on the throne. She appears to be isolated here. It does show this phenomenal isolation that she is apart from us all, but that doesn't mean that she isn't part of us all. About the only face you don't see here, Prince William's new bride, Catherine. Not even a wedding snap. The curator explains why. We're exhibiting the queen here, not Kate. You know, absolutely delightful as she is and how wonderful the wedding was. But no, this exhibition is the queen. It's all about the Queen. You're going to hear that a lot this year. And in case you're wondering, she was not a part of the selection team, but she did give the final photos her royal seal of approval. Very nice, Charlie. Thanks. I love seeing some of those pictures. I was going to say, didn't your mom always tell you when you were a kid, you always look better when you smile? <laughs> that, that's certainly true. I love how Harry said in the beginning that, you know, the queen walks in and she lights up a room. I don't think, Erica, most people think that about the queen. No, it's definitely not the impression you had when we were there covering the royal wedding oh, that's last right. you year. Were there. Well, that's one right. of the great things that we learned from all of these royal watchers that we spoke to is they all have these anecdotes about the queen and about the royal family actually being very fun-loving, loving to joke, and being very warm in person. Yeah. But it's so few people who get into that arena to see it that we just get the story. That's good to know. And we also know the queen likes the umbrella to match her clothes. <laughs> yes, indeed. Note to self. And I always wonder what she puts in her little handbag. <laughs> Extra pair of gloves.